What is musical embodiment and why is it crucial for the musician and the music they make? My name is Mike and for 15 years I've been helping musicians tune their bodies for music making and what I've found is that embodiment skills are really the soil from which a lot of important musical skills grow. So what do we mean by embodiment and how can it help us refine our musical practice? Well, from the perspective of brain science and of functional anatomy, we can call embodiment the skill of perceiving, identifying with, and expressing the state of the body in the present moment. So now take that and apply it to practicing music or performing music. Perception. Are you able to perceive with clarity and depth what your body is doing in relation to itself, in relation to an instrument, in relation to the space around you? Identification. Do you take emotional ownership of what's happening? Are you believing what's happening? Expression. Are you able to fold in story and symbol into the act of music making? Are you able through music to communicate what's happening in here to those out there? These skills have brain systems that stand behind them and when they're functioning well we see a fulsome and vital musicianship. When they're functioning not so well we see gaps in musicianship. We see injuries arise. We see uh, a musical skill set that could grow more. When they're functioning well, we get some really wonderful insights from cognitive science. We see things like kinesthetic empathy. That means that your music making is able to uh, move other bodies in subtle and not so subtle ways. We see we're able to create a common moment between us all, emotionally, physiologically, etc. That's kinesthetic empathy. We also see that when we're really embodied, we have improved cognition of space and time. We're able to sense the flow of time better, and we're able to sense space, physical space, temporal space in our music making. We also know that a well-embodied nervous system is able to learn music more fully. We're able to do things that is called common coding of sound, of movement, of emotion, of imagery. We're able to learn more dimensions and then express those dimensions musically if we are more fully embodied. So this gets us to some very deep and also some very practical implications for music making. If we are more fully embodied, we have better depth in our practice time. We have more vitality in our performance and we tend to avoid injury in the making of music. And overall, dare I say it, we tend to enjoy our music making better. So if you're curious about embodiment as it pertains to music. I've got some excellent references in the description of this video and I'm teaching a course coming up called Embodied Anatomy for Musicians. It's an online course. You can take it live or on your own time and it's intended for musicians, music educators, anyone who helps musicians. And so I'd love it if you check that out uh, and I hope it finds the people whom it would help. Thanks for watching and have fun making music in your body in relation to other bodies. Have a great day.